this is selection sort and what you're doing with selection sort is always keeping track of the smallest known value so right now that's five it's the one i've colored blue but as we iterate through this array we're probably going to find a smaller value so let's do that so currently we're at six it's not smaller than five neither is seven but three is smaller so we make that our new smallest known uh, value and then we just keep going two is smaller than three and one is the smallest one so then we put it here on the left and this is our sorted partition so we're going to add values to this one and it's going to be completely sorted uh, it's going to fill up the entire array eventually so we're going to continue six is our currently smallest known value and now it's three and now it's two and then we put it in the sorted array three is the smallest one none of these are smaller and four and five and six is already in its place so we don't do anything and now it's seven and then eight and then we swap these last ones so now the array has been entirely sorted uh, but i also want to show you a different way to visualize this so here we have rectangles instead and their height corresponds to their value so it's the exact same thing whenever we find a new shortest uh, rectangle we put it in the sorted partition so i'll let you enjoy this and thanks for watching